Hey guys, so I just bought a massive sports card collection. I placed an ad on the Nextdoor app. I think you guys have heard me talk about that before. And basically I just said that I'm looking to buy sports card collections. I recently gotten back into sports card collecting, reselling everything. Actually, when I was a kid, my dad and I collected a lot of sports cards, open packs, and you know, try to complete sets. And I'm just really nostalgic for it. And it seems to be coming back really big now. So I've been looking to buy some collections and get back into it. So somebody messaged me on the app and said that they had a bunch of stuff and sent me some pictures and it looked pretty good. So I went and took a look at it and it was just, hundreds of boxes of stuff just a, a ton of stuff more than i thought was in the pictures it was hard you know i didn't look through like every single binder and every single box but the guy definitely knew what he had and he actually recognized me he watches the channel he was totally up front he's like look i buy out collections and you know over the past few years this is what i have left um, i think he had kind of pulled out some of the best cards he told me he sent a mike trout and this you know grading for psa so this was a lot of the leftovers i think he didn't want to mess with so probably you know you know mickey mantles or michael Jordan's in here, but that's okay. I offered him $500 for it and he accepted. And I'm not going to go through and show you guys everything because it would take hours, but I'll at least give you an idea of what I bought. So there's a good number of sealed factory sets. You can see there was some garage sale prices here. I don't know that the guy had those necessarily, or if these prices were just on there when he bought them from, you know, whoever was selling the collection. But there's a good amount of like baseball, football, just a wide variety. So like here we got a 2002 tops mlb complete sealed set this is interesting hit football includes reggie bush and matt liner so that definitely dates it it's a bunch of sealed packs another 2000 oh wait, this is 2005 that was a 2002 complete set tops 2004 2006 most of these are worth i think between 20 and 40 dollars each so i'll probably try to list these first and you know recoup some of the costs just because these will be pretty easy listers we got a 2008 complete set there's two of these those are 2001 we got a 91 football another 91 football bowman 2006 tops football 97 upper deck there's troy aikman on the cover 92 tops football here's another um 2002 Tops Baseball, 90 Football, 2003, here's a 2009, let's see, this one, okay, so that's sealed in there, 2007, here's a more modern one, 2018, Shohei Otani, Aaron Judge on there, 2006 NFL Score, 91 Tops Football, this one I think has maybe been opened, no, it's got tape right there, so I don't know. This one's maybe been opened at some point. And then 1990 Bowman Baseball. And we come in here, and this is the bulk of it. So everything you see against this wall is from this collection. Just so, so, so much stuff. It's kind of crazy, to be honest with you guys. There is a lot of these. I don't know if these are like blaster boxes or like, yeah, some kind of retail box. But I think these have all been opened. So these are going to have like a lot of loose cards, probably from those years. So we got a lot of like 2006 football, what this looks like, 2007, 2007 upper deck, a lot of the same stuff over here. We've got garbage pail kids. That's pretty cool. Again, I think these have been opened up. Yeah, there's just a lot of loose cards down in there. Got shoe boxes full of cards. These might be team packs. Tops gold. Found a little bit of vintage in these. 50s and 60s, but again, I haven't dug through any of this stuff yet, so I'm not really sure what all is in here. There's an old red, Claude Osteen. More shoe boxes. Each of these boxes has a bunch of long boxes in them. We got more stuff in here. There's some 2007 Prestige, Vince Young on the cover. A Danian Toblinson, 2007. Box of random cards, a couple of binders. He said most of the binders are complete sets. And I haven't looked through these yet, so we'll see what we got. This looks like Don Russ from 82, is that right? This looks a little newer than 82. So yeah, here's some 83 Don Russ. More stuff over here. Just a random box of cards. 
that is in no. And here we got a couple cards and cases. It's a Reggie Bush rookie, it looks like. King Griffey Jr. At least Transformers cards. That's kind of interesting. Yeah, Transformers movie cards. That's different. Yeah, there's uh, multiple boxes of those. Looks like four boxes just of Transformers cards. Here's a case. These are all football. Tops Heritage from 2006. Definitely seems like there's a lot of 2006-2007 football. There's a Reggie Bush patch card. That's pretty cool. And believe it or not, every one of these cases is full of cards. Come back in here. Some of the binders I went ahead and put on racks. And I do believe some of these are complete sets like he was talking about. So we've got football here. And when you look on the back, looks like they've been numbered in order. So one, two, three, so on and so forth. So this should be a complete set of 1999 tops. Is that right? So yeah, we've got some good players in here. Warren Moon, Terrell Owens, Doug Flutie. And yeah, it just it just goes all the way back. And then here's some extra stuff too in the back, it looks like. Maybe some inserts. And then down in this box, we've got a graded Mickey Mantle. This doesn't look like it was anything released by Tops or anything official. It says 1987 all-time great, so that's not any kind of... Original Mantle or anything, but still a cool card. 1997 scoreboard Mickey Mantle. Some Bengals cards. Palmer, Chad Johnson, Rudy Johnson. More football. It says alcohol prep pads, but I can definitely see cards in there. Just kind of use the different box. Got some Bengals cards in here. Matt Leinert. Carson Palmer. Chad Johnson. That's a cool card. That's when he was at Oregon State. Rudy Johnson. I'm excited to look through these some more. I know there's a lot of work involved and I probably won't make a ton of money for the amount of work that I put in, but this is gonna be fun for me. It's just gonna be a hobby. I'll probably just take a box home every night and dig through it and see what's in there. Noah, if you're watching this, thank you so much for the deal. Hope we can do business together again. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. <laughs>